Justice, that's what some are feeling in Wilson County after a man is arrested for, shoot for the shooting death of a five-year-old boy. CBS 17's Imani Payne is in Wilson tonight. And Imani, how did this even happen? Well, the suspect was on the run for one day before being located and arrested by Wilson PD officers, along with help from the U.S. Marshal's Office. Now, the little boy's family gathered here at Walmart today to honor him, and they say while this arrest does not bring him back, it does help them start to heal. Five-year-old Cannon Hinnant no longer here, but still leaving an impact. The community calling for an end to violence against children in his honor at this event organized by some of his family. Really, everybody just wants answers, you know, for why this was done. The boy's uncle says Cannon was outside with his siblings playing on his bike when he was shot and killed by this man, Darius Sessoms. He's now booked on a murder charge with no bond following a day-long manhunt. He was found at a home in Goldsboro. The family says they've known the suspect for many years, even living near each other. We used to play together yeah. and I never thought he'd kill someone. A mother now has to lay her son to rest at five years old, which she should never have to do. The town mayor shaken by the tragedy, coming out to pay his respects. I have a child that's five years old. My heart broke. My heart broke right then. I, I, I went home. I went home right then and I, I took my baby and I just hugged her. The family says Cannon was set to start kindergarten today. But say he's now fulfilling a new mission with a higher power. Oh, he'll never be forgotten. The family says they now begin the process of planning a funeral. For now, we're live in Wilson. Imani Payne, CBS 17 News.